Here we will see alert message in PHP. An alert in PHP has the form of an alert box which is displayed in front of the users as a warning message. An alert message acts as a pop-up window that appears in front of the user on their screen. This pop-up window can be used to deliver certain messages or information to the user as alerts. Since PHP is a server-side language, it does not have the feature of pop-up as an alert message box. But you can use the JavaScript code within the PHP code to display an alert message box. JavaScript is an interpreter-based scripting language as it requires no compilation steps. The browser can interpret JavaScript statements in the same way as it interprets the tags of HTML. It is an object-based high-level language as it can access various HTML objects that are contained in the web page. JavaScript has three types of pop-up boxes. Alert box, confirm box and prompt box. First we'll see alert box. A alert box is nothing but a pop-up window on your screen with some message or information which requires user attention. An alert box is a JavaScript dialog box that is supported by the browser. Since PHP is a server-side language, it does not support pop-up alert messages. The browser of the client renders an alert. To pop an alert message via PHP, we need to render JavaScript code in PHP and send it to the browser. General syntax for alert is alert and then type your message here. Alert and the message that you want to display. For example, alert welcome to YouTube channel. Next is confirm box. A confirm box mostly used to take user's approval to verify or accept a value. In confirm dialog box of JavaScript, the JavaScript's confirm method is used to confirm the user's action. If you want the user to verify something, then use this dialog box. Confirm dialog box displays a predefined message with two buttons, OK and Cancel button. The user will have to click either of the button to proceed. If the user clicks an OK button, the box returns true to the program. And if the user clicks the cancel button, the box returns false to the program. General syntax is confirm and message. Here an HTML document is written where we use the confirm dialog box. Here in if statement confirm is used with do you want to save the changes equal to true. It will add the user preference equal to data saved successfully. Else it will save saved cancelled. And when we execute this script it will display the message do you want to save changes. And if we click on OK, it will display data saved successfully. Next is prompt box. Next we will see prompt box. A prompt box is often used if you want to input a value before entering a page. It takes two arguments, a message that you want to display in the text box and the text box default string. The prompt dialog box also displays two buttons, OK and Cancel button with the message. The processing will halt until the user clicks one of the button. A prompt box is mostly used when you want the user should input the data. Here user needs to fill the data into the given field displaying in the pop-up box and has to click either OK or Cancel to proceed further. General syntax is prompt, message and the default value. For example, here inside the script tag, prompt is used with please enter preferred tenure in years and the default value will be 15. When we execute this, it will display the message. 
when we execute this script and click on ok it will display the message you have entered 15 years